Hey guys, how's it going? True here, and it's time for another Daily Isaac. If it's working, I'm going to play it. That's how I feel, and it's working right now. Um, there we go, Isaac. I'm still rusty, guys. But I'm not going to go for double going. If I die, I die, and the episode's going to end. Hopefully, though, I don't die. Um, I think I did end up winning yesterday's game. I ended up losing one game just because I was stupid. I do think I might have ended up winning that game. If I wasn't stupid. I want to emphasize the key part in that is I was stupid. I got the High Priestess and the Empress mixed up and ended up costing me the game. And that's a good deal for me. I get checked for a secret room and I get my bomb back. So I will gladly do that. Um, I would love to find a secret room. The idea of having five cents for a second floor arcade would be amazing. I'm not going to get another reroll either. It's a basement, one floor, so I'm also looking for the item room. Let's see what we get. I'm going to be able to take a look, compare boss items. Well, realistically, normally a boss item is going to give you a. Um... Oh, wow. It's not too bad. Uh, we can do this. I do want to get that, so we're going to put this here. Come on, go. Okay, good. It should blow up that rock and get the terror card. And check our secret room, what we got. The magician. That's a worthless item, but okay. I think Stigmata is I got close to all stats up, the damage and health. So I'm happy to have it. I've checked one, two. I've checked two rooms for secrets. Um, I'm only down to one bomb, so I'm good with that. We're gonna use our magician card for shits and giggles. Just to simplify this boss even more than it is. Without the stuff in between, it can get a little risky, as in, um, there is no real safe areas if the berms get near me. But at the same time, I got pretty open range besides poop. I just can't, I can't get caught in their flow. Their rhythm. Way they freaking go. I can't get caught in it. When I do, I'm done. Uh, easy enough, and dog food, I will gladly take it. So, first of all, we got two HP ups, and I do think Stigmata is actually a damage up, so. We got bomb, no keys. Keys? Uh, a little lacking in keys. I would like some keys, but I'm not going to expect any. Ideally, I do want to do this floor perfectly, because I would prefer if to get a get a get, get, get. <laughs> I need to learn how to talk again. I would like to get a um, double double. I might get hit here. This is a bad situation. Yep. I got pushed into a corner. I wanted to do whatever I could to avoid that um, special one. I'm not going to pick up the Spirit Heart just yet. I've already been hit. Ain't no point in me picking up now. Um, the reason I say that is my chance to deal with Devil's already been shortened. So picking up now would do nothing but um, basically give me a Spirit Heart for the boss, which I can end up losing. I'm going to try to save the Spirit Heart for the next floor. That's how I feel about it. I mean, I've already taken damage, so I mean, I, there's still a chance I get de devil, but I'm not going to bank on it, you know? Alright, these little orbs, I mean, the way monster spit works always confuses me. And the way that I've learned to deter it is to look at the shadows. And it's really hard to do. Um, I have, my eyes just don't want to work that way, but looking at the orbs is not the way to dodge it. Looking at the shadows is the way to go. HP up, don't mind if I do. Of course, there was no deal with the devil. Um, sort of expected that. I would like to find a secret room, but with only one bomb, I almost want to save that for a tinted rock. A uh, small rock would be good, and keys and spirit hearts are always a plus. And tinted rock has a chance to drop in all of that. Uh, I was worried for a second that I was hoping I'd get him caught behind a rock and give me more than enough time to get by. But and Empress, 
Okay, that's the damage buff. The bomb bag. I gotta think about it. The reason I say I gotta think about it is this. The bomb bag is not a bad item. It's not. It basically will... In it will secure me for bombs for the rest of the game. Ideally. The reason I'm doing this now is if I get like five or so bombs, which I'm coming really close to, um, I might not grab it. Mm. It's a half decent item, so I can either A, take a half decent item and be happy with it, or B, risk getting a poor item. The hermit. I think that's to the shop. Let's take a look. Oh my god, I'm so happy I did that. We got a seven cent compass. The chances of that working out are so slim. My phone is going crazy, guys. Sorry, I'm about to take a look at it. The floor is clear, so we'll go ahead and snag that. Holy crap. Alright. So, we're going to come back here, grab our Empress card. Um... Oh, man, guys. Well, you know what? I love to gamble, so I'm going to risk losing a half decent item for. <laughs> the sack of pennies. Which honestly isn't bad either. It's gonna be constant income. Um after bomb fight it serves no purpose, but other than judgments and such, but hmm. okay. Well, that's what happens. But I'm actually okay with this because hopefully I can get enough money for the shop. Ideally I want I want my have enough money to try to get a arcade on the next even floor. So the very least I'm, I get five cents. I'm pretty sure I get five cents from the freaking sack of pennies. Pretty easily. Alright, heart, bay, we got the shop. Go ahead over here. Yeah. That's a no-brainer right there. Seriously? We are going for the devil, so I will pick up a spirit heart. A little mad that whole thing didn't work out what I just tried to do. Alright, I need a key. I don't regret opening that golden chest in the last floor, but that is actually what let me afford to buy my um, compass. Come on, guys. These guys are just meat tanks. Oh, there's a penny. And this guy's going down. Easy enough. This guy should hopefully go down as well. Yep. Um, we'll wait time for the boss. We need keys though. Um, ouch. Ouch. I am dodging really bad, but I'm happy I picked up that extra spirit art. Three cents. So two cents away from being able to get a arcade next floor. Holy big balls of blood. Going down. That's four cents. Okay. I need one more cent. A uh, little chad. I have no qualms using one bomb pistol. Even more so if it takes out one of the little guys, too. I auto reflexes that second bomb. If it was a choice that he was either going to hit me or I use a bomb. And I used a bomb. That didn't look like he was out there, man. I can control his flow a little bit as he gets smaller. He's pooping out red bugs. I hate these red bugs. They are one hit from being killed. Yep. I even knew they were one hit from being killed. Come on, go down, little Chad. Spirit heart. 
Uh, little Chad, you're great. Hey, you give me one cent. Let's see what we get. Over Babylon. We're gonna roll. This is a no brainer, guys. No brainer. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and grab a little Chad. But Miles HP as we've gotten so far, I have no problem picking up a pack of brimstone. We got five cents, there is a chance for arcade next floor. Guppy's head, oh my god, that is awesome. If these pills are good, I'll be happy. Bad trip. That's okay, I will hold on to the Empress card. I think I'll hold on to the pill, but the pill won't help me much because... I need to be down to like a half a heart before it's a full health bill. Then again, no, I'm not gonna worry about it. Let's go. Wow. This is an ideal floor. Let me explain, alright? We got a boss trap floor, boss trap room, we have an arcade, and we got spirit hearts. The sun. Okay. We are in good shape, guys. So, what we want I want to do first is... I'm gonna come over here. Stop being bad. Come on. Uh, I'm gonna come take down the boss first and foremost. Alright. We will have a reroll. Awesome, there's a chance we can become Guppy. Oh god, this is bad, guys. I'm I'm on sneeze, but double damage. Oh, you got me. Can't get hit anymore. Come on, go down. Gotcha. Nine lives. I gotta think about it, guys. Nine lives does mean a few things, alright? That's the sun. Alright. The reason nine lives means a few things is this. One, it's one step closer to being guppy. Which is honestly a win-win situation. Ouch. And there's our key. We're already here. Nickel, awesome. Alright, we're gonna have to cut that spirit heart. Alright, so, now here's the deal. I want to proc a blood bag. The reason I want a blood bag is because it's HP. Awesome. Puberty, that's surplus, but... Alright, so here's what we're looking at now, guys. Alright, so, we're going to go ahead... Come down here, we're going to grab nine lives. Now, the reason I'm grabbing nine lives is this, um... Some reason, I'm not 100% certain about this. But I think the game increases your chance for HP ups if you're down to one HP. I remember that from somewhere. It's very possible that it's a completely made up thing, but the map, some sense. I'd be silly not to buy it. And an extra spirit heart. Wow. Alright, so this is awesome. I got full freaking uh, visibility on everything. Um, that's worthless to me. Alright, so let's go ahead and go on in here. We're going to go. That's the sun. So easy. I'm gonna use our Empress because I want I've already the sun with me. You know we're down just one heart. The sun is still awesome where it does damage and heals. I don't plan on being on one heart forever. Alright, so we're gonna keep going. 
Actually, we go pick up this. We go pick up our blood bag now. Actually, uh, we'll hold off for now. We got Squeezy. That's when it should increase our charge time, if I'm not mistaken. Guppy's ball, guppy's ball. Damn. Bombs are key, that's... It's actually really good. I didn't even think about it, but we needed that. <laughs> uh, sacrificial dagger. That's a solid, that's a solid item. I like it. Um, it is a really offensive item, for sure. And when I say offensive, I mean basically it's as offensive as offensive can get. With the risk of me being hurt. It's an orbital that does high damage. Um, it's actually one of my favorite items, I won't lie. I love utilizing orbitals. Favorite thing to do. Alright, so realistically, let's look what we got on this floor. Alright. We got nine lives. Lost one heart. Um, sacrificial dagger. That's the spot, that, which isn't too bad. Man, wants me to keep playing. We gotta speed up too. Ouch. Alright, that really hurts. Um, okay. That's not terrible, though. We can manage this, guys. Um, not thrilled at all about that, though. Won't lie. Pretty annoyed. But, alright. But, thankfully, we did get a, um... Wow, I can't remember its name. Wow. We got the item from the boss trap room, and... Oh, shit. Alright, so our boss room. Wow. This is shitty. Thank you. Head straight for the item room, even though we don't have a key. Seriously. Seriously? Ow. Alright, when it rains, it pours, right, guys? He would be nice. We don't have one, though. Alright, so. We got a path to our first item room. So we just get there. We'll get a key. Launch charge. Um, until then, we're heading towards our boss trap room. Ideally, I can't get hit. I need all the hearts I can get right now. I am in a dangerous spot. There's a key. Awesome. This is like a perfect opportunity, what we got in here. Alright, so. This isn't a bad choice. If two HP downs drop, one won't drop. That is technically an HP up now. Um, I can't remember what looks. But I think I've gotten that before. So we are going to get our HP back. I hate you so much, Pete. Really puts me in perspective that I am not doing as much damage as I was hoping. So even if I'm snapping, it's not taking its HP down as much as I want it, need it to. Okay, so this should be an HP up. That's a question mark. Sun, bad trip. Alright, so HP up. Full health. Okay, so there is a full health fill on the rotation. Alright, those are bad trips. Okay, so we got our HP back. That's probably the best thing that could happen for us right there. We're gonna come down to this item room since we did get a key. The shop, I am fully suspecting greed is there. No, we don't want this. Razor Blade is not my playstyle. That clearly I don't give up the D6. Charm of the Vampire is interesting, but my goal is to become guppy. 
So, meaning if I could get this pole, the item would be useless. Meaning I don't want it. Alright, so let's just start heading towards our next uh, spot of interest, which would be the secret room. That's another HP down. That's interesting. Interesting. The shop will be good! Greed is in the secret room. Well, are the chances? Okay. So the reason that's interesting is that health down symbolizes this for me right now. Um, what it means is if by some chance I do get Guppy's Paul, that's another three spirit hearts. Essentially. Or if I do a devil on another floor, I don't have a key. Fuck. Alright, we're going to start heading towards our next item room. Um, or if I had use another de devil, it's HP back. Meaning, I think it might be more valuable than Sun Card at this moment. You, sir, are valuable too. You're very valuable. Honestly, other than Nun's Habit, there's nothing I really could want from the shop. Um, but him, I need keys. Well, enough, I need a key to go to the shop. Funny how that works, and you're taking all my money. Watch me nuns have been there. I'm not, actually, I'm not worried about it. Give me HP up, Judgment. No? Actually, I still have more stuff. What are you gonna give me? Nothing! I know I'm racing rerolls right now. Actually, I really should just go back and reroll the item that I right now I don't want. But I'm already here. More money. That's not. That's not even a gallon challenge question. Guardian Angel? Yeah. Guardian Angel is probably one of the best items in the game. Offensively and defensively, especially in combination with Sacrificial Dagger, and if I get Cuban Meat, that's some that's some danger right there. That's a major threat. Come on, bomb! Well, I'll take it. All right, so let's go do our reroll. Um, we don't have a key for the shop yet, but we got plenty of reroll options on this floor. We have not taken red heart damage yet, meaning there's still a chance we deal for the devil. Monster Manuel. Doesn't help me much. Now, deal with the devil for me, get that. I need to be able to teleport out of mom's room. Mom's fight. Which is very possible. I still get a uh, card for that. Love it. I honestly, these are probably my worst the enemies I am weakest at. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, if I get another key, I will go to the shop. Just because I wouldn't mind the nun's habit. Book of Sin. Okay. Which, this isn't bad. The books are not bad. I'm happy to get them off my item list. Because... Now that I've got one book, there's always a chance for more, but that's how this works. You get one book, the chances for libraries increases. Thank you. 
All right, so there's another judgment. I need some money. Um, I did get the coin purse, which I'm actually happy for, surprisingly. I will take it. It's a speed plus range up. I'm okay with moving fast. I still have plenty of rerolls. I need to get the judgment fail for starters. So, every penny counts. Wow, I am really, really fast. And I was only going this fast. Steam cell, that's worthless. And I'm okay with that. Don't complain about that. I do want some rerolls, though. That's a pretty fucking solid item. Well, not a solid item, but. Yeah, that's a fair trade. One for two. No brainer, really. All right, so rerolls ready. Um, let's go break the spire. Never know who has money. And it's just time consuming. I know, guys. Sorry, but considering the last judgment was a little bit of a dick about paying out, I am concerned about this judgment's choice of money threshold. Well, I don't think the, I don't think it's a choice. I think it's like a pre-programmed thing. But I like to think the death, the judgment's being an ass. It makes me feel better. And we are really fast. Which I am okay with. Hopefully it doesn't bite me in the butt. It probably will though. Right here, the moon. Perfect, that's the teleport. Alright, so I've paid out judgment very well. Um, so we can try for a devil from mom now. Um, Still want judgment payoff because I still got plenty of rooms to get um, rerolls. Dilt Devil. Here's what I'm gonna do. If I can, if I get flying, I mean, if I get guppy, I'll be in fucking good shape. Um, bloody penny. I don't have a trinket, so might as well. Alright, so here's my thinking right now. Kill bomb. No, we got two bosses. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Alright, so. If we kill bomb. Teleport out. Get that red pill. Get dealt double. There's a one trade. We can use it. And, okay. This is going to be an easy fight. I really appreciate you not doing that again. I don't want to hit at all. Squeezy! That's what the item's called that I was thinking about before. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. Alright, go back Now to see if we can beat Mom without me getting hit. Which one is it? It's the normal Mom. There's one hit already. Damage. That was close. Got her. Didn't get hit. Uh, we will grab the HP up. We will grab the Polaroid. And we are going to teleport out to the moon. The moon takes us to the secret room. Let's do this. Not my letters, lovely. Which means we are wasting a reroll, regrettably. Oh my god, I don't want to die. Alright, let's hope for a deal with the devil, guys. If we did get one, awesome. If we did not, whatevs. Oh wow, this judgment didn't pay out yet either? I didn't realize neither judgments paid out yet. Fuck. The judgments are assholes. Tricked me. Well, they didn't trick me. I'm stupid. Double, double? Yes, it is. Um, we do this. Well, we do this. Get spit art. Do that. You're 
able to just shovel. That's useless. I wish I had three spirit hearts. I would love to get spirit tonight, but alas, no such luck from that. Alright, so. We need money now. Golden poop might just be what we need. Some sort of flying would be good too. Counterfeit punny. Counterfeit penny. Alright, so I gotta remember do not forget to pick up the Polaroid. Or this game will be over real quick. I need that money. Tears down, ouch. So he kill himself. I thought he was, but I guess he didn't. Oh my god, I'm gonna end up dying if I'm not careful. Maggie's face would have been nice a couple floors ago, but okay. What? A third judgment? Are you serious? Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. Oh my god. Not what I had in mind. So we just lost the heart to my stupidity. That's lovely. Um, that really sucks. <laughs> Give me an HP up? Please? No? You're an asshole. Alright, so, um... Ouch. How about that? Um, almost wish I would have saved a bad trip. Well, the bad pill was what we gave us an HP up. No? Son. That works. Counterfeit Penny did proc once. Wow. <laughs> Counterfeit Penny. Um, kind of a dick move not paying out there, but. Alright, so. We're not in great shape, guys. We got nine lives, but it could result in just a whole bunch of losses. Depending on what the judgment gives us. The Empress, that could be cool. It's more useful, useful than the sun now. Blue candle! Close to a saving grace. Mr. Boom! Nowhere close to a saving grace. Alright, we'll take the Empress because it will be better for us than... The fucking, uh, sun. Sun, I don't have no life to heal, so full health pill really doesn't help me much. We'll grab the Polaroid. Um, so I'm in really bad shape for the Polaroid too because I can't even proc that invincibility. Uh, and we're going down. Alright, so where are we at? I can't technically even go in here even though I want to. Um, yeah, we'll do this. I know it's expensive, a bomb, and a key, but Sad Onion is awesome, so... Yeah, I'm okay with that. Speed up our charge time. Very much so. I am one hit from dying from anything on this floor that we're at now. Come on. So being careful is something that I really need to do. Until we get spear art. Alright, so. Now I got a decision in front of me. Uh, never mind. I got hit like a scrub. Which is impressive. But, still not done yet. There's always a chance. Um, what is my hair? Skullix, okay. Whoa! That was quick. Oh yeah, I got the uh, speed ups because there's that. Kill the devil, see what we got. Got this Paul. Take it. I'm gonna die from it. That's fine. Lucky foot. We roll it. We lost our D6, guys. It sucks. I know. 
But we got the Guppy's Paw now, and we are Guppy. Um, we got the full Guppy Supreme setup. Tears down, no thank you. I found pills, no thank you. I end up dying, that's okay. We use a fall, we got three hearts now, with invincibility. That's why I grabbed Guppy's Fall. I don't want to speed up, but I feel bad if I leave it. We're a super fast cat now. More importantly, we are Guppy, which means we are awesome. I do want to go up here. My flash, we can take care of him. Nice. Any HP up is going to pay off with three spirit hearts and invincibility time, which is invaluable. That is a speed up. So I'm gonna grab it. Call it. Ideally what I want now is damage ups. My HP should be fine. Extra two. He's going to get caught in my rhythm. He's done. This boss room is done. Let's see here, no luck. No. Ouch. That's expensive to get some flies. Whatevs. Alright, keep going. Plenty of other places we can get HP up. I was sort of hoping for HP up there, but no cigar. Dear God, mask. They got. They're so fucking strong. This is my point. Bounce around pointlessly. Die. Fuck you. I'm trying to think it would be. Nah, I'll save the Empress card for Isaac himself. That doesn't help me much, but. Help me if I needed to do chess on this floor, but it's gone. You notice I am utilizing my uh, dagger and guardian angel. I am being careful not to get hit at all because I don't want to, and we are going on up. Going on up. Alright, so library might be tempting to check out. Um, secret room, tempting. Right, we're making little detours. I'm sort of getting caught in my rhythm. Man, am I pushing my luck. Bombs are key? No thank you. No thank you. That. So it costs us a spirit heart, but I think it could be worth it. And it is worth it. We got our spirit heart out of it. Um, I don't have any bombs to check it out, so we did get a key from somewhere. Pretty dumb summon things, a bomb. We need to go check out that secret room now. Greed should go down real easy, like. Steam cell, interesting. Uh, let's look for dummies. Or not, just cookbook. If one one was a book of reflections, I probably would have took it. We'll grab the steam shell for shits and giggles. Um, I do want to check out the secret room, because there's always a chance for uh, raw liver. One well, up wouldn't be bad either. Or this. This is actually really good too. I'm worshiping a sun god. That's terrible. I don't want to worship a sun god. Actually, Sun God's pretty cool. Another Empress card that actually is a huge help. 
because we will have a for blue baby. Which wouldn't be too bad if we could get the horror of Babylon right now. We'd full time more. Huh. So also, I find myself saying full time more. Hmm. I mean, it's not something I aim to be too often, but I guess I wouldn't mind aiming to be a full time horror kitty right now. Not to be a horror kitty. Hey, look. That was an awesome payout. We even got a bomb back to get back in there, get that card, and we kill Isaac. We're not gonna kill Isaac, but it's nice to have Thank you for paying out now, coin purse. We got extra keys, so might as well. Worthless! Alright, Isaac time. Alright, I'll pop this while well, Terminal Night for a curse. Not doing as much damage as I was really hoping I would be doing, but what ifs? If whenever I do get hit, I'm gonna come in here. Now I'm gonna say hello to my uh, Sacrificial Dagger and Guardian Angel. Which as you can see, did a ton of damage to him. Now we're to the final phase. I'm gonna finish him up right here. Now we're gonna come back here. I just want to ensure we can win. I'm pretty sure we don't need the Horror Babylon to win. Defending what we find on the freaking um, chest. Chess is basically a game changer. Oh, I went to the wall for a second. That was weird. I was worried for a second with my luck that the uh, flies would grab the actual bomb and move them, but thankfully they did not. So, Squeezy was the item I was thinking about before. I didn't mention that, but I remembered. All right, we're going to the chest. Let's see what Lady Luck has for us. Salt Cross. I love that item. Game Kid. Relic. We'll take the relic. The suit and bottle of pills is. I found pills, that's worthless. So the cross, we'll grab that. We might as well grab the game kid because we don't really need to go be spawn anymore. We got the Empress. Game kid. The more often we use it, the easier time to be. I mean, there's no reason not to use it. Probably should have been our best lens first. That's on scene the way you're supposed to do this fight. But I sort of just didn't care. I just sort of went for whoever. Sure, come out, my friend. Double monstro. They are going to get caught in my rhythm. It's very important. If you have two double monstros, especially monstro two, very important to that you get them in the rhythm. Because if you don't, the spike can actually be really rough. Oh, no, I'm a key scoops. Uh, could always get a good tarot card here. The Empress is really good, but I think the Empress is probably the best I can get. If I get High Priestess, I can always just glitch out Blue Baby. Um, which could be fine, but. Done. Oh, sure. Alright, four hearts. Let's do this, Blue Baby. So we are going to be dropping bombs when we go in here. Say hello. Bombs are going to poison him. Basically, this is my best chance to win. But I, got the most possible, I got the most possible health I might get.
Yep, we win! Hey! Hey, good job, guys. We won. Well, it's probably you guys that made good items drop for me. It was all you guys. Other than my stupid mistake running on the spikes, it was actually a pretty good game. Um, there's a couple things I probably could have done differently, but eh, can't complain too much. It all worked out in the end. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.